L, M, N, P, Q, R is a regular hexagon. Calculate the size of angle L, R, M, U, giving reason at each step. So the question is, you want to find this angle. L, R, M, and this is a regular hexagon. Now, <clears throat> Regular hexagon means all the sides are equal. So you can say this side is equal to this side. Or you can say triangle LRM is an isosceles triangle. And as it's an isosceles triangle, the base angles are equal. So you can say the first thing is triangle LRM is an isosceles triangle. Is an isosceles triangle. Okay, which implies base angles are equal base angles equal now what does that mean you can say l r m l r m i'll say this is angle l r m is equal to angle this is the notation for angle l m r l m r okay so we know this if this is x, this would also be x. So I want to find this angle, which is the interior angle of a hexagon. So let me draw a hexagon. Now, there's a formula for finding uh, the interior angle of a hexagon or the sum of interior angles. So let me write the formula. The formula is like this. Sum of interior angles of any polygon. Sum of interior this is a good formula to remember. It's a very simple. I've made a video on this. Sum of interior angles of any polygon, of any polygon, has got this formula, which is equal to n minus 2 times 180, where n is the number of sides. Where n is the number of sides. So if, okay, so let, let's use this formula. So this implies sum of interior angles, I would say sum of interior angles of this polygon would be n is, this has got how many sides? 6. 6 minus 2 is 4 times 180, which is 720. The sum of all the angles is 720. So if you add all the angles, that would be 720. There's, you can prove this also <clears throat> in a different way. Uh, which says, which is a different rule that if you add the exterior angles of a polygon, uh, they add up to 360. So which implies, I hope you understand, angle L would be 720 divided by 6. So this, each of this angle is 120 degree. Okay, or if you think in a different way, I want just to explain this in a different way. Suppose if this is the center of the hexagon, uh, if you draw, if you think in a different way, so let's think in a different way, we can prove this in a quite easy way, in a different way, I just thought about this now, suppose you're splitting this into, so each of this angle, there are six angles, I hope you can understand this would be 60 degrees, because you've got six angles, so this is 60, and this side is equal to would be equal to this side is equal to this side in a hexagon okay so is it, it's an equilateral triangle so this is 60 and this is also 60 okay so all the angles are 60 so this angle is 120 i'm explaining this in a different way so this angle l you can say an angle l is equal to 120 okay which implies angle LRM, angle LRM would be 180 minus 120, and that you have to divide by 2, because this and this are equal, so this is 60 divided by 2, which is 30 degree. So each of this, so you can ask, say the answer is 30 degrees, please.